What if I told you? Right now, China is there on the far side of Moon for a hidden mining operation which could disrupt the world power, break the internet, and redefine global power. A mission so quiet, so secretive, we don't know the full scale of what's happening, because we don't have infrastructure up there to even see what's going on. The other side of the moon, most people may not know this, we can only see one side of the moon in the way that it rotates and orbits around the Earth. Without constellation of satellites flying around the moon that can see and understand what's going on, we're totally blind. They knew about it, and that's why they chose the far dark side of moon. Cut to black. One breath of silence. They've been there for years, and we're just realizing it now. So what's being mined in silence? Not gold, not oil. But something infinitely rarer. Helium-3. Helium-3 is a miracle isotope for the future of energy. On Earth, it's almost non-existent. But the moon? It's everywhere. If someone gets ahead, if they bring back enough helium-3 to fuel quantum systems and fusion plants, they won't just lead the world, they'll own it. It could power the planet for thousands of years. Clean, no waste, no radiation. Imagine a world where the energy crisis doesn't exist. Now imagine only one country controls that energy. That's the kind of power we're talking about. But this story goes deeper than energy. Let's talk quantum computing. Recently, Microsoft unveiled a breakthrough. But here's the catch. It needs to be cooled to 80 millikelvin. That's colder than space, colder than liquid hydrogen. The only substance that can do that effectively? You guessed it, helium-3. So if China has helium-3, and they unlock true quantum computing, they win everything. They could crack every encryption, every bank, every blockchain, every military secret. Bitcoin, gone. Privacy, gone. National security, gone and we'd be powerless to stop it. Now, you might be thinking, wait, the US has the best tech on Earth. Satellites, fighters, rockets, AI. True, but China isn't trying to out-tech us. They're out-strategizing US and the whole world. While we build better gadgets, they're building the future's infrastructure in space. Think about that. Logistics depots, power systems, data networks, all off-planet. We're building toys. They're building a system. And that system? It's designed to dominate not just Earth, but the space around it. These hidden missions have been operating for over two years. We've seen pieces. We've tracked some shipments. There's evidence, yes, but not the full picture. And that's the most alarming part. We don't really know what's happening, because we've never prioritized watching it. While we innovate inside Earth's boundaries, China is thinking beyond it. And that decision, that shift in mindset, could decide who controls energy, information, and economies for centuries.